Oh, what's happening, my people? It's your boy Chance Jollibet, aka Smooth, back with another video. This is something I haven't did in a long time on the channel, man. Like I used to do a lot of my uh, colognes and stuff like that. I just haven't been buying any, anything recently, man. Like I pretty much got like a lot of the stuff that I want, and then a lot of brands and stuff that I'm a fan of is like they just have flankers and stuff. Like just go from the the EDT to the EDP to the parfum to the it's like all the same, so I'm like, anyways, but I got this, this sample, this was uh, a few samples and stuff, it was in, in a pack for my birthday, man, shout out to me and my kicks, and so this right here is Parfums de Marley Layton, so I had heard about this, I watched a lot of like different fragrance uh, uh, YouTubers and stuff, and I seen this on, on a few lists and stuff, so it was something I thought about, something I was curious of. So I was able to wear this yesterday and I wore this today. This right here, I'm happy about this and I'm mad at the same time. I'm happy because this smells beautiful, elegant. This smells like money. I'm mad about it because, damn, they only got just a little bit left. But shit. So was able to check this out, man. Give, give it another little squirt. Ugh. There you go. Yo, this right here. This right here is beautiful. The opening is very sweet. It's very sweet. I want to I want to say like cotton candy ish. Like it's it's in that realm of sweetness right here. Uh, after a while, you, it has a, a a large like vanilla vanilla tone to it, like vanilla hint, vanilla scent and stuff, with a little a little twinge of like some kind of spice. But the spice is like in the in the like cinnamony type type thing. I think this is this is something this is something that would be like summer, springtime. I don't think this would be uh the later months. Maybe maybe fall, maybe early fall you can get through with this. I don't know if this is like a winter scent. Like it's not it's not heavy, is cause it's it's sweet, it's sweet, light, it's playful youthful i think this can be unisex i can see a female getting by with this because of the sweetness and stuff uh definitely a compliment getter i'm, I'm pretty sure you're gonna get compliments with this man like this the price on it uh is it worth it i think it's worth it but you ain't about to get it's not cheap i think the cheapest i might have seen it was like maybe 170 180 on ebay so I'm pretty sure the price tag on it is probably like 200 plus. Uh, so it is a little pricey, but it does smell smell wonderful, man. And the the wear time with it, like about the first the first time I, I smelled it, I had like a hoodie on or something. I'm like I'm like I don't think it, it really it's really pushing out too much. But like I had like a little less uh, layers today. It moved around. I'm like, it was wafting up on me. I'm like, it does, it does have a little permeation to it. It, it evokes a, a little bit. So I'm like, maybe about the two hour mark, like it is, it's pushing out and stuff. And it give a nice scent bubble, give a nice scent bubble to it. And it stays on long. Like yes, yesterday, I, it was about the 10 hour mark. And I was checking, and I could still smell it good. But it was a skin scent at the time, like it wears close to the skin. It's not something that people are gonna. I don't think people are gonna smell you across the room. I don't think you're gonna drown anybody with this right here. But if you're not into sweet fragrances, I don't think this would be for you or whatever. Um, what other points do I need to make? Uh, overall, overall, man, I would give this like a nine point. 5 out of 10. I would give this a 9.5 out of 10, man. Uh, a little bit of the fragrance, man. Parfums de Marley revives the splendor of the lifestyle of Chateau de Marley, a place dedicated to pleasure and celebration. Each fragrance has its own olfactory signature derived from a palette of noble ingredients reinterpreted for a unique experience. Named after one of the most prolific lines in the thoroughbred history, Leighton boasts of top notes and man of Mandarin apple, lavender, then moves on the floral combination of violet, jasmine, and geranium. The base notes are composed of guac wood, patchouli, sandalwood, cardamom, 
vanilla and pepper. Layton brings out an elegant signature. And I agree with all that they said. Uh, pricey, worth the price. 9.6 out of 10, man. Has longevity. Compliment factor is there. Just smells great. Uh, will you GTD? I think you GTD. Get the trolls down. <laughs> but anyways, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Gonna be the greatest in the most. Hey, man, I let you boy.